G'day guys, my name is Mahulen and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am on my way to one of the weekend markets in Darwin, Australia. The name of this market is Rapid Creek Market and it is open every weekend in a suburb called Rapid Creek. There are some special features about the weekend markets in Australia. The first thing is you can buy fresh fruits and vegetables straight from the farm. And the next thing is price of the vegetables, fruits, food and other items you buy in these markets are cheaper than the other places. Most of the people working in these markets are from Southeast Asian countries like Thailand, Cambodia, Myanmar, Vietnam and China. Now I am going to go inside this market, film this one and show you all through this video. I would like to ask you guys to consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon and without further delay let's go inside and see how this market operates and what are the things available in this market. This is the entrance to the market guys. These weekend markets are normally crowded like this. Let's start from this stall here. There are a few fruits like banana, watermelon. On this side you can see cucumber, chilies, lettuce and a fruit called chocos. You can see the price of each vegetable and fruit mentioned on there. There are more vegetables like broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, pepper chilies, eggplants, succini and on the top you can see beetroots, leeks and other green vegetables. All these are fresh products guys. In the next stall you can see some bitter melons guys. There are a few different kinds of them. There are also bottle gourd, snake gourd and rich gourd guys. On this side you can see drumstick and snake beans guys. There are also green leaves available here. Look at this one guys. It looks like a stem of some plant and they say we can cook using this one. There are some fruits here guys. It is very rare to see jackfruit in Australia. Here is one. There are also few other fruits and vegetables on that side. In this stall, they sell packets of chilies and okras. You can see fresh turmeric here guys. That's $2 per bag. This is a Thailand shop guys. And they sell different kind of sweets and cake items made from rice and flour. Alright, we bought a sweet from this shop and let's try this one now. This is the item guys. Mm, it is sweet and tastes good guys. I reckon they made this from flour, sugar and coconut milk. This is the previous item we saw guys. Let's ask the name of this one. Excuse me. What's this one? How, how do we cook this one? Soup. Oh, okay. Just cut this one and eat. They are saying that we can chop this one and make soup. I couldn't understand the name they said guys. If anyone know the name of this one, please leave that in the comment section. Wow, it is mango season in Darwin guys. You can see plenty of mangoes here. And on this side, you can see some sweet items made from dried mangoes. There is also Thai massage service available here guys. If you want a massage, you can come here and do. You can see some free range eggs guys. These are straight from the farm, fresh and healthy. And after that, you can see some more mangoes. They are colorful and tempting. The name of this mango is Kelsova. Let's taste this. Mm, it is sweet and yummy guys. Some people use mango before it becomes fruit. They are selling green mangoes for those people. Look at the size of this mango guys. It's very small. What are we gonna do now? Popo salad. Popo salad. Yeah. Alright, we are gonna try a recipe called Popo salad. What's that one? That yellow color one? Popo. Popo. That's Popo slices, guys. 
They are making this salad using popo. Bit of chili first. After that, she is putting some garlic inside. Then she is adding some nuts. I reckon this should be healthy. After that, she is crushing all these using the wooden stick. Then she added the popo slices inside. Now it's time for sugar. Oh, now she is adding some squid sauce into that. After that, she adds some lemon juice. After that, she adds juice from a ripened lime. After adding everything, she crushes and mixes everything well. So this is how the purple salad is made, guys. All right, guys, this is the purple salad. Let's try this one. Oh, it is bitter, guys. I reckon it is because of lime and popo. Maybe you can try this one. They are saying it is good for health. Look at this crowd, guys. It is for a coffee shop. It is a Greek coffee shop and they sell good coffee here. You can see few more snacks and sweet items in this stall as well. In this market, they also sell some plants. You can buy them and maintain in your home. You guys are now seeing few Australian indigenous people singing in their language and performing an art performance. Let's join these guys for a while. On the outside, you guys can see there are food and drink stalls from different countries. You can taste different food items from different countries here. Look at this shop guys. There are a few different food items of countries like Thailand, Indonesia and Philippines. Here is another shop guys. Oh, these guys are also selling popo salad guys. You can see different kind of food items here guys. I reckon these food items are from Thailand. This shop sells Indonesian food items guys. This is another colorful juice shop here, guys. Look at this Amma street food. They sell authentic Sri Lankan food. You can see fair amount of people here and there are some other food shops on that side.
All right guys, now I am going to have some fruit juice from this shop. They are having fruits like purple, watermelon, rock melon, honey melon, pineapple, mango, etc etc. This use is thick and yummy guys. It is always good to have some fruit juice when it is hot outside. All right guys, that's it. That's all right for this video. I hope you guys would have liked this video and if you did so, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon. I will see you guys in another beautiful episode. Till then, thanks for watching and cheers.